What's up guys, welcome back to Minecraft story mode. We're in the killer's lair. Yeah, that's be able to get some it. string from those cobwebs. It'll go perfectly with those sticks I found. Break them. So now we can make a fishing rod to get the lazy cats off the chest. Who fishes in Minecraft anyways? I mean, I don't fish, but some people do. Oh, to get a fish! Cats love fish! Yeah, and I saw one in the pond that'll be perfect. Well, why'd the ankle just get greener? I don't know, but it just got greener here on my screen. I don't know if that's what's happening. Not. Ah. Wow. Bingo. Nice catch, Jesse. Thanks. Bet that cat'll love this. All right. Cool. 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 So now that we got that, we should give it to the cat. What if he just okay, doesn't here, move? Kitty, get the fishy. No. Meow yourself. There you go. Jeez. Whoa. Many cats, so many cats. Ugh, cats give me the creeps. Why? None taken. I'm not really a cat. Guess I can finally get in here now. It's full of portraits. Loads of them. Oh, I don't like that. I guess he already had all the X'd out ones ready to go. Yep, besides Petra, we've got Dan, Stacy, Stampy, Lucas, Ivor, and oh hey, there's me. But what does it all mean? Wait, what's Cats, Cassidy? The crossed out portraits? Yeah, the wedhead. Yeah, the portraits. There was one person who didn't have a crossed out portrait. Someone who's a known cat person. The whitehead. Okay. So who did it? Yes, you figured it out? The white pumpkin is Cassie Rose. She's the murderer. Oh. Man, you're totally right. I don't believe it. Uh, not only is she the white pumpkin, but she owns way... Way too many cats. Well, oh, come on, you guys. It's time to prove Lucas's innocence and catch us a white pumpkin. Got the answer. I vote look Lucas, or you know, Lucas would be killed. Why is that boy's hair? But you know, around I'm everyone else. Ask. What's going on? We found yeah, who it is. Yeah, you've got an awful long time. Quickly, where's Cassie Rose? Cassie, why do you ask? Yeah, what's up? No hey. sign of Cassie, but huh? <laughs> Are you gonna tell them, or should I just do it? Uh, I don't know what you're talking about. Jesse, go on. Is this going where I think this is going? The white pumpkin is Cassie Rose. <gasps> She's the murderer. <laughs> That's impossible. No way. No way. Yeah, Jesse, I'm afraid you're gonna have to do better than that. Look at the facts. We caught Lucas with that pumpkin head right after poor Lizzie got taken out. I think you're just lying to protect him. Cassie's We're going making a lot of sense right now. Hallway. Do you have any evidence to back you up? There's something that's been bothering me for a while now. Something that happened in the Great Hall shortly after Tork Dog was hit with that trap. What's that? Go on, Jesse. You've got this. Where is this going? Shh. Let Jesse finish. Cassie said she recognized us, even before we saw the portraits. Uh, actually, that was Lizzie. Oh, shoot, I guess I misremembered that. Well, no matter. I haven't even gotten to the really juicy stuff yet. That came next. When we were down in the basement, we found some very interesting items. Items for the White Pumpkin's evening festivities. And there was one very significant detail. What was this evidence? Shh. I think Jesse's about to tell everyone. 
The White Pumpkin had portraits all ready to go, pre-exed out, one for each of us, except for Cassie. <gasps> Ooh, that's good. Okay, Thank you. I think they're on the fence, but you can do this. Bring it home, okay? But it was the last piece of evidence, dear friends, that helped me really figure out who we were dealing with here. A buttload of cats? Dozens of calico cats, and they all look just like Winslow. An amusing story, Jesse. But if you saw all these supposed cats just like mine, then what color is Winslow? It shouldn't be a problem if you saw a hundred. Cats? Simple. Really? Shh. Black. Winslow is black, white, and orange. <laughs> Cassie, is this all true? This whole thing has been about your crazy scheme to get a portal key, hasn't it? Killing whoever gets in your way. How very clever, Jesse. Well, I guess that's it then. You caught me. I am the murderer. It's daytime outside. This. I know. I was shocked too. I'm relieved. But also surprised. But what did any of us ever do to you? Directly? Nothing. But you idiots had the one thing that I most desperately needed. I've been stuck in this stupid world with its stupid two moons for years. Trapped with a portal right under my nose, but no key to open it. That is, until I finally heard that this world's portal key had been found. I knew it was one of you. So I tried my best to earn your friendship, figure out who had it. Cassie, how could you? We shared cookies together. Cookies! You really think that's an excuse? You're pathetic, Cassie. It doesn't excuse all the horrible things you've done. Spoken just like a person who has no idea what it feels like to be stuck somewhere you don't belong. We need to do something with you, Cassie Rose. I vote we build an obsidian prison and surround it with love. No, 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 I won't let you do that. I can't. No. This is your fault. You did this to me. Ah. I'll fight all of you. Each and every one of you. Ah. Whoa. Another trap. We need to dig her out. I no, we do She's hurt. She can dig herself out. Yeah. She did terrible things, but no one deserves this. Nah, I'm with her. Wait, look! I can't believe it. She's gone. What a way to go. Yeah, I guess in all the chaos, she forgot where her own traps were. Wow. After everything she did, she got what she deserved. If only she had just asked us for help, we could have avoided this whole thing. Hey, it's morning. I guess, I guess that's it then. Yeah, we're free. And we're alive. Let's not waste Yay. standing around. There could still be traps everywhere in here. True. Good. That crazy lady's finally done for. I've never been so happy to smell rotting flesh. Yeah, that is... Yikes, that is pretty rank. Yeah. I feel bad thinking about the people who aren't here to smell it. Talk Dog, Sparkles, Lizzie, and Cassie, I guess. Mm. Uh, that's a good point. Yeah, I didn't mean to depress anyone. I just can't stop thinking about them. Dang it, dang I tried my hardest, but there was nothing I could do. Oh, we all know that, Jesse. It's not your fault. Lucky for us, that portal brought you here. Speaking of which, I have no idea how to begin finding our exit portal. Well, Cassie said it was right under her nose, right? That's true. Maybe it's nearby. Hey, what do you know? There it is. A fabulous coincidence! Yeah. So, I guess this is goodbye, huh? Yeah. Just let us know if you ever accidentally find yourselves in our world. <laughs> That's really nice of you, but I don't think we can really portal hop without a portal key. Oh, uh, well, I think Stampy's got you covered there. You stole the portal key from me? 
It was just meant to be a prank, a harmless prank, and I'm so sorry, so very, very sorry. Yeah, come on, it's Stampy. You know he would never actually try to hurt anyone. And so the drama continues. Fascinating. Leave Stampy alone, you guys. Like you said, it was just a prank. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Some prank. Look how badly it went. After all this craziness, I might be done chasing flints and steels and portals anyway. Well, I'm not great at goodbyes, so I'm actually just gonna start walking home. Thanks for everything. Yeah, me too. Travel safe, you guys. Bye. There go those two. What a strange, strange bunch of individuals. Stampy was the weirdest. <laughs> look, look at that guy. Cassie, what's her name, was talking about being trapped here from another world. What if she was one of the old builders. Portal keys, other worlds. It all adds up, I guess. No way. Nah, I think she's just another traveler like us. I feel like an old builder would have more of a special vibe. I guess that's true. I just can't yeah. believe that we finally met someone who might be an old builder, and she's a pumpkin wearing serial killer. Typical. Well, here we are. Would you care to do the honors, Jesse? Yes, sir. Huh. Let's do this. Huh? That's weird. Winslow? Oh, cat. That's strange. I thought... Oh! Dang it, Winslow! That's why dogs better than cats. Cats try to kill you. Oh! <laughs> What happened? I can't see a thing. Well, that's oh. ominous. Do you hear that? Endermites! And there it is, Jesse! You're trapped! Stuck! <laughs> Just like I've been in this rotten world. I knew you weren't dead, Cassie. I knew it was way too easy. And yet you still walked right into my best and final trap. I don't know how much time you've spent with Endermites, but the poor things are eternally hungry. I would throw the flint and steel up here before I drop you down to find out how sharp their teeth are. Uh, guys, I dropped the flint and steel when we fell. I have no idea where it went. <laughs> tick tock, tick tock, Jesse. What's it gonna be? The flint and steel or your lives? Just give me the flint and steel and I'll let you go free. I don't believe her. Okay, you're right. You win. We'll give you the flint and steel, but let us out first. <laughs> no, I'm not falling for that one. Nope, this is taking too long. I'll just let the Endermites eat you and fish it out of your inventory. It'll be the best fishing trip ever. <gasps> Winslow, my pet, activate the trap. Want something done right, Hagen? Prepare for your death! <laughs> Guys! Jesse! Come on, Winslow. Well, that's not gonna work. Stupid door? Oh, that's no use! Without a lever or button, we'll never get these iron doors open. Just hold on, guys. I'm gonna get up to the control panel. You are? I mean, we are? <laughs> Oh, that is disorienting. Uh, it just started going faster. She booby trapped her booby traps? That is so paranoid. What? You thought you could do it just like that? Trying to get leverage? Give me the key, Jesse. Guys, no! No! Hey, Jesse! Guys, holy crap, you're all alive, thank goodness. Dang. Yeah, for now. Don't worry, I found a lever. Throw it down. Okay, get ready. Got it. Okay, you guys get to safety. I need to find that flint and steel. You're not a fast learner, are you? 
You don't have bad reflexes. I grow tired of this game, Jesse. The key. You didn't have it either. Oh no, it's mine. Nope. No! <laughs> no, we are going home. No! You can't do this! I've waited too long! Mine! Cassie, I won't let you have it! Went low? No! No, Winslow! Don't touch that! Winslow! No, 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 Winslow! Bad kitty! Stop it! Winslow! Good boy! Sweet kitty! Bring that to Master! You stupid cat! Don't threaten my cat! Only I threaten my cat! That makes no sense! No! I think you should give that back, Cassie. No, I'm afraid not. Hey. I'll give you one thing. You are incredibly tenacious! Thank you? <laughs> That's never back, Jesse. It stays on fire forever! Well, Winslow, that's the last of the obstacles. We're finally going home! <laughs> Come on, Winslow! Winslow! Winslow, come on! Down for the love. You know I love you, but you make me very tired sometimes. Hey, cats suck! What did you say? You heard me, cats suck. Things are way cooler. I'm not playing it, but I'm bored with it. Ah! 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 What's going? Ah, I've got it. Excellent. I did it. You're all dying now. Uh, no, thank you. Got it. No! See ya. <coughs> I bet you're real proud of yourself. Look at me, stuck again, yeah. out of Ender Pearls. Yeah. And that's where she wanted us to end up. Trapped in my own trap. <laughs> of course, of course. You got what you deserve, Cassie. You've been ruthless and selfish and mean, and this is where it gets you. Wait, at least don't leave me here all alone. Give me my cat. My dear sweet Winslow, he's my best, my only friend. Please. Here, kitty. Here, you pain in the butt, kitty. Ah, there you are, Winslow. Who loves you? Come to master. Oh, there you are. There you are. You and me are together forever, just like it was always meant to be. Trapped together forever. Crazy. Just me and my little Winslow. Wow, so she kept the real portal hidden down here all this time. Unless this one is a trap, too. I don't know if even she'd be that paranoid. Only one way to find out. Trap, a trap, a trap? No. It's real. Good side so far. Yeah. No trick floors or arrows or anything. Okay, sure. But who's going first? We're a team. We all go together. Ready? One, two, two three. three. Adventure! Ooh. We're, get, we're going home. Nope, we're not. Oh my gosh. Of course we're not. Why would we? 
All right, what's going on, dudes? It's me, Captain Sparkles. Oh my gosh. Next no. time on Minecraft Story Mode. After defeating the dreaded White Pumpkin, will Jesse and the others find their way back to the portal hallway? And will it lead them home? Or instead, Ugh. are they destined for more perilous adventures? Well, I guess Bacos. I'll never know because I got pounded into the ground by a ton of sand. Yeah. I guess you saw that, right? I'm in the middle of an amazing speech, and boom! I've suddenly become part of the floor. I mean, dude, you saw that, right? How much worse can it get? First, they choose not to invite me on their adventure, and the next thing I know, I'm part of the floor. Anyway, one thing's for certain. Even without me, this is going to be an amazing adventure. Go make a song or do parkour, whatever you do, Sparkles. So yeah, guys, that was uh, that. Like, subscribe, share this, share this to everybody you know. Even if you don't know them that well. Even if you see them on like a daily basis and don't know their names. Share it to them and um... Yeah, like, comment, subscribe, share, like I said. And get your neighbor and smash your face with the whole head into the like, comment, subscribe button. Okay? I don't know how to make them comment, but you will. And next time we got this. Okay guys, peace out.